Welcome back gamers. Today we're playing a little bit more of Hearthstone Battlegrounds. Today we're gonna go ahead and start off with my boy, Sir Denathrius. This guy lets us start off with a quest and we're gonna go ahead and choose the one on the right. Fill the cauldron after each refresh. Give a minion in the tavern plus six plus six and divine shield. Now that will come and play probably later. Uh, we get a pretty unique build. Uh, based off of the fact that we can get minions that don't normally get Divine Shield with Divine Shield. Uh, the stat boost doesn't really matter as much, but uh, we're going to go and start off with the boy, Lil Pup. Remember when I started uh, getting back into Hearthstone? Or when I started getting into this game mode? Uh, Lil Pup was, he was pretty goaded. We're going to go and start off. We, of course, lose the first, uh, we lose the second battle. Uh, because Lil Pup has 3 HP, just not nearly enough. We level up the second round. And then now I'm kind of just contemplating, hey, do I want to buy these or do I want to just upgrade? Because honestly, all these minions in the shop are pretty trash. I decided to go ahead and sell the little pup and go straight into Tavern 3. A little bit aggressive, but either way, we still would have lost that battle. Like, our low pup did not have enough uh, damage to do. Uh, so we're going to go ahead here and pick up some minions because I need something. So we're going to pick up Soul Reminder. We're going to pick up the little ooze. Little ooze is going to give us a taunt. And plus two, plus two on the Soul Reminder. Soul Reminder is pretty good. Soul Reminder plus, uh, I think it's Malkazar, right? The guy who lets you do refreshes for health pretty good combo pretty good combo uh here we're gonna take the second soul rewinder we're gonna take a naga and this naga gives us plus one health if our minion dies uh then the stat change is gonna be permanent and everyone died here because we just yeah we took a straight l there lost 10 health we're at 15 right now pretty not good but um we're gonna take chef's choice and we pull probably the worst elemental we could have pulled. I, you know, that's okay, I guess. But, like, I really need, uh, you know, more actual good minions. So, we're going to go and take the extra three health for a gold card. And then we got the boy now. We can finally do some free, uh, some free uh, refreshes. And we're going to make sure we hit him right now. It'll give us an extra health and we pulled an extra two of them so we're gonna get a golden next turn more than likely pretty nice of course we lost this one too uh now we're sitting at a whopping four health really love to uh start the game off with four health pretty cool pretty cool I'm gonna go and get a golden and to be fair here what i could have done i probably could have leveled and then gotten the golden card but you know of course it is what it is could have sold probably one of the Nagas. Here we got a 10-7. We got a 10-7 guy, which actually would have been not awful to pull. Got an 11-8 mech. Tunnel Blaster. Tunnel Blaster is pretty good. Tunnel Blaster is actually putting a lot of work. Um, a lot of people are still playing dragons right now, which is pretty crazy. But pretty good against dragons. It's, it's, it's uh, aside from that, it's not super great. We're gonna go and start off. Got our first two minions with Divine Shield. Notice I have a demon with Divine Shield and now I have a mech with Divine Shield. Pretty cool, pretty cool stuff. We win off of getting three of the little bot thingies at the end of the battle. We're gonna go and make sure we rank up first before we continue going on. <laughs> and there we go. We got our third minion with Divine Shield. Uh, the Soul Reminder. Here I think we actually end up picking the tree because he's just the best out of the bunch. I don't really need gold and having extra attack on my minions is pretty cool. Gives us a little bit of a uh, menagerie synergy. That's kind of what we're, kind of the build that we're looking towards right now. And here, pick the Rat Pack. You already know, baby.
And here we actually get a pretty nice roll. Uh, we get a bunch of 1-1s one to hit the tree. <laughs> that's a lot of attack in one turn. Look at that. Woo, that's a lot of attack. This actually probably was my best battle. Right there, just like... I don't even know how much... That was a lot of attack. That was a lot of attack. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, here, we actually pull Trigor, which is pretty cool. Uh, kind of synergizes with the Rab Hack. Obviously, it'd be best if I were to... Actually, I guess I don't pull it there. I, uh... Oh, Trigor is a nice little synergy card. Here, I decide to pull the Naga. I'm gonna go and sell some of the random junk that we have. Uh, Tunnel Blaster. I probably didn't need to pick it up earlier, but... I'm gonna play the one mech. Gonna get the Murzond. And we get a second Rat Pack. We're gonna get the Magnetic Spell. And here, we actually get a, uh... A Trigor with the Divine Shield. And there's a second one in the shop with the Divine Shield. That's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, as you can see right now, I got five minions with the Divine Shield. Pretty good. Pretty good. We're going to take that one, do the 15 damage. Here decides to go in and take the Lullabot so I can upgrade, uh, or I guess level up my Magnetic Guy a little bit. Get the Rat Pack with the Divine Shield. Pretty cool. And of course, we take the second Tree Ant. Hopefully get a Golden eventually, but uh, if not, it is what it is. It's a pretty good card. Nice little boost up for my board. Take the wand drop spell since I'm not going to have enough gold for anything else. And here, yeah, we got a pretty nice little menagerie board. We got some free uh, some free spins every turn. We got the Daog and the Trigor. And um, the Menace is also getting us a little bit of extra gold because we got, the, uh, we got him with the coin guy. So at the start of every turn, we'll get like an extra gold right now we still got trigor leveling up that's pretty good take another magnetic so now at the start of each turn if i'm not mistaken right now we're at four gold which is it's a lot of gold. It's a lot of free gold. To be fair, at this point, we probably could have sold the Naga if we really wanted to. Um, at this point, the extra want health isn't doing a whole ton. You know, it's not super great at this point, especially when we already have minions with Divine Shield. So it doesn't matter that much. But we're going to go straight back into combat. And our Divine Shields are just putting in a whole lot of work. He actually had a pretty big implicator there. Had like an 87 attack or something silly. Uh, but, you know, Divine Shields just kind of put an end to that. Here we pick up a Utility Drone. Um, I guess eventually we could have had actually a swap over to full mechs. Because right now we're actually about to hit 6 pretty soon. Uh, but at 6 we get the Beatboxer. Which is great with other mechs. And here we actually could have pulled, uh, probably could have saved the, um, the six drop spell. If I'm not mistaken, it's the Mother's Grace or something, right? The six drop spell. Could have gotten a golden, probably a golden Trigor or a golden Utility Drone. Those would have both been pretty useful. Uh, but I decided to skip over it. Get a few more spins in just in case we get something really crazy.
right now we're starting off the turn with 16 gold pretty good pretty good flying menace with divine shield would have been pretty cool uh sadly i don't think i don't think flying menace is good enough for me to try and swap over to complete demons here we pull the beatboxer just trying to see later on in the future hey i might swap over to complete mechs mechs are pretty pretty good pretty pretty fun pretty fun archetype and i also pull the magnetic spell that'll give us a magnetic at the end of every turn again could have uh I guess out of this, there's really not a whole ton I would have swapped out. Uh, kind of looking back at it. Especially since I have most of my minions with Divine Shield. Pretty good. If anything, the Utility Drone could have gotten out for the V-Boxer, to be fair. And here we get the, <laughs> we get the full Rat Pack. Pretty cool. 15 more damage. And now we're into the top four, baby, with, uh, of course, four health. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. We're all just very, we're all just hanging on by a thread. Get another free gold. We'll get some more tavern spells with a little rollomatic. Not a lot of great things in, uh, in some of the, in most of these shops right now. Not great. And I decided to go ahead and sell the Trigor because... Yeah, I'm just going straight into mechs at this point. I don't really need uh, the Trigor and the Rad Pack combo. Here I messed up. I still have like an extra two gold or something, but... Eh, we'll ignore it. We'll pretend like I, like I meant to do that on purpose. Here we go. Rolling Matic. Don't slap out two guys. We we'll actually get some pretty decent spells. We get 8-8 uh, eight, eight taunt and we get a 1-2 taunt. So, not too bad, not too bad. And then we're going to go ahead again. 16 gold. We're already in tavern 6. We could potentially get a golden Rollomatic, but... Not yet. We got a golden utility drone. It's going to be pretty good eventually. Decided to get rid of the taunt on the world of Matic because, you know, obviously we don't want to keep him taunted. Uh, we want to try and get him so that he can get two full attacks every time. Got him up to 35 attack. Got another Trigor. Another Trigor. Got the Cobra, the Bison. I don't know, man. This game was kind of funky. Just really no... No specific direction I could have pulled, but I mean, having free divine shields and everything was pretty cool. And yeah, here we go. Pretty easy win. You had the bull, but um, not good enough, brother. Not good enough. <laughs> 